Hey everybody, I am Dominique and welcome to my channel. So on this video, I'll be sharing my 34 week pregnancy update with you guys. And I am currently 34 weeks pregnant today and 5 days. So tomorrow, I will be 35 weeks pregnant. So that means I really only got 5 more weeks to go and then I get to meet my bundle of joy so but anyways let me share with you guys some of the symptoms that I've been having so I've been having nausea this week I've been also experiencing vomiting and you I would think right now that you know I'll be done with vomiting with nausea and actually in my first trimester I did not experience it any nausea or vomiting but in my third trimester I'm finding that I've been experiencing that along with heartburn um, I have but my heartburn is not that bad I realize heartburn um, it depends on what I eat uh, I was eating pretty clean for a couple of weeks and my heartburn actually kind of went away basically and um, I was eating a gluten-free diet I was also just eating more fruits and vegetables and I was eating brown rice like I eliminated the white stuff you know but I went on vacation I went down to North Carolina and that kind of messed me up a bit. So I have my heartburn. The heartburn is back and I hate it. Um, so that's what I've been experiencing. Another thing that I also have been experiencing um, is contractions. Actually, when during the time that I went away, which I was probably 33 weeks or I'm not sure, but I, I know this is a 34-week pregnancy update. But I actually felt the baby down in my vagina area. And I was just like, whoa, is the baby trying to come out? And another thing I also experienced during the week that I went away was leaking. My, um, my breast was like leaking milk. So... I, w I looked it up and they said like that's perfectly normal I actually thought about like actually starting to pump right now which I wish I, I wish I would have asked my doctor about it but I looked it up and the nurses on YouTube because they have this nurse I think her name is Lakewood I don't know I'll put her name on the screen I'm not sure but mountain lake moms I don't know but she said don't pump right now because that actually can bring on premature labor so I said nah I'm not gonna bring on premature labor even though I would like to pump right now so by the time the baby comes I know I have you know good amount of milk supply but I said you know it's not worth it let me just wait but that is something new because I actually haven't experienced it. I had two other babies. I have a one-year-old and I have a three-year-old. And I've, and no, she's actually four right now. So I have a four-year-old and a one-year-old. Um, and I haven't, I didn't experiencing, I didn't experience leaking of, you know, the breast of milk um, with the both of them. So it was... A pretty new experience to experience that with this pregnancy and also I didn't experience you know feeling the baby down in my vagina area with them so that was a pretty new experience and another thing was pretty new to me is that I'm also having contractions like every single day I think I've been having some type of contraction um, it's not that it's it's consistent so I know I don't have to rush to the hospital but it's enough to make me feel like whoo this hurts and I stop for a minute and I close my eyes and it goes away but um, you know I guess it's just my doctor I told my doctor like about that and she said like 
that's normal as long as you do not feel it consistently you know as long as it's not every five minutes you're experiencing contractions then you're okay it's just your body preparing for labor so this baby could come anytime now this baby can come early this baby can come late but I feel like the baby's gonna come early because I've never experienced this with any of my other pregnancies but I'm praying that the baby comes 40 weeks and that's my prayer I don't want the baby to come earlier because I'm not I'm not prepared and although I do want to meet the baby right now but I am not prepared and also I just I'm not ready right now like I just want the baby to just come on the baby's due date so please come on your due date come on your due date don't rush to come but anyways that is enough about me and that's all I've really been experiencing um, I haven't had any funny cravings that I can think of um, I've just been you know that's pretty much all the all the symptoms that I've been experiencing so now I want to show you guys my bump and what it's looking like now <sighs> okay so this is how baby's looking now I hope you guys can see my tummy So that is how baby's looking right right now and I'm excited about meeting my baby and I also want to share with you guys some of what is going on with the baby right now. So right now the baby is the size of a pineapple and also the baby is the size of like say if you lift up a five pound bag of flour that is compared to the size of the baby right now so the baby is about five pounds right now um another thing is the baby is produ producing sex hormones um and boy or girl they're both so like you might see, so that's why we see like when the baby's born, their private area is more like darker than the rest of their body. It's just because of those hormones. But of course, you know, it, it, it regulates along the way. And also the baby's skin is just, you know, um, basically have that lubrication, I believe. So it's easy to like so the baby's it's it's easy for the baby to go down the birth canal so that's another thing like that the skin is I don't know how to describe it right now but I'll put the wording on the screen because I don't have I know I don't have the wording completely right but that is what's going on with the baby right now which I think all of those things are amazing and that is the end of this video i hope you guys enjoyed this video and stay tuned for my next videos and i hope you guys have a really 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 beautiful day today it's a really nice day today in new york it's kind of warmer than what it usually is so today is a pretty good day but anyways have a nice day